Hi guys, I'm on the chair now with uh, James Bennett from uh, Basie. He's a Alpine and Telemark trainer examiner and he's also on the demo, t demo team for, both, for Alpine and probably mainly Telemark too. Uh, how's it going James? Yeah, really well. It's been a, it's been a good day. Sweet. Um, have, I suppose, a few quick questions. One of them is, uh, what do you think makes a good Telemark turn? Oof. I think that ability to be able to continue moving the whole way through the turn is quite a big, yeah. big point. Um, obviously, having just gone through the workshop we've just gone, um, that idea of being able to make sure, like, ensure we are actually in a telly position so that yep. we're not ending up. We have a, like a term called like telly lellying, mm -hmm. which I suppose is your kind of link into that fake telly mark position. Yep. Um, but I'd, yeah, I'd go with that kind of consistent movement being the, being the main uh -huh. point for me. Cool. Um, since you guys aren't presenting, mm. um, what does the, is there anything the English telemark system stresses? Well, I suppose actually like if they, to take it from the workshops we did, did yesterday. Yeah. Um, yeah, they were on Alpine skis, but the, the kind of the content remains the same. Mm -hmm. So we pushed uh, our, like our tide model, which is a decision making process for instructors to be able to basically be quite adaptable in how they prescribe feedback, but then also how they develop the mm -hmm. performer as a whole. Yeah. Um, and we kind of, we, we basically looked a little bit about our criteria and where we're looking for people to have to grip from. Um, I'm going to link those two together, but the main one's that tied idea that we're looking to basically be able to create adaptable ski instructors. Yeah. Nice. Um, just a final fun one. Mm -hmm. uh, if you could teach any historical figure how to tell a mark, who would it be? <laughs> oh, this could be reckless. <laughs> um, if I could teach anyone, probably go, well, maybe go Alicia Cuthbert, but... Um... <laughs> <laughs> Historical. It's historical. <laughs> From my uh, teenage years. <laughs> nice. But, um, so yeah. No, no I, I think I think I think I just quite like teaching anyone that would really want to teach, that want to learn telemark. It's kind yep. of few and far between that get to do it. So you know, spend a lot of time on alpine skis for sure at the moment. Okay, sweet. Well, thanks a lot for that, James. Cheers. Thank you. No worries.